Welcome back to Let's Talk Dreams, and today's episode, Be Pirates. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome back to episode 8 of Let's Talk Dreams. Today's episode, as you've guessed it, is Pirates, and we've even got a special guest who's going to do our assets today. But first, we have to go back to last week and check out who won the MVC coin. So, without further ado, the winner of the asset portion of the animal theme episode is... Idex Tiger for the Gigantosaurus Sculpt. And the winner of the dream portion is... Mezzi Artist for Pet Cafe. Congratulations to both of you. Your work was amazing. Now it's time for Captain P. Ingalls to tell you about the assets. Thank you, Red. First of all, we have Unexciting Barrel, Pirate Cove by Beard of Cats. You know, I've been in this pirate game a long time, and I've seen many unexciting barrels. And it's all fun and games until the rum is gone. And did I mention only 2% thermo? Next up, we have Dead Man's Chest by Mark Wunderbar. Wunderbar, is that German? Doesn't matter. Anyway, this comes in at a nice 9% thermo and makes the perfect addition to any pirate adventure. Remember lads, X marks the spot, hey? Eh? Next up is the Flying Dutchman by Oogle Squid. This one comes in at 9% thermo and is perfect for sailing the seven seas or ferrying the souls of your enemies and bounding them to your ship forever. Stay away from the liar's dice. Here we have the Blunderbuss by Lucid Stew. This one comes in at a minuscule 3% thermo so you can outfit your entire crew and you won't even skip a frame. So you get a pistol and you get a pistol. Everyone gets a pistol. Next up is Brown Feathered Pirate Hat by Ollie Boyle Lolly Loyal or something. Only 1% thermo. And remember, every good pirate needs a hat, which is why I'll be stealing this one. Keep up the good work, Lola Boyle. Thanks, Phineas. You did great. Now, if you don't know who Phineas is, he was actually part of my own pirate adventure in Red in the Cursed Isles. Available now, but aside from that, it's time for the dream portion of the episode. So, if you want to head over onto YouTube and watch it, you can. And of course, we have to thank It's All Star, aka the Tenya, for putting together an amazing pirate-themed showcase. Well, it's time to crack on with the episode. If you're staying on dreams, I'll see you next time. Bye! And welcome back to the dream portion of the episode. <laughs> so, coming up first this week is Pirate Predicament by Pear Joss. This fun dynamic little art piece shows pirates battling the mighty Kraken. With lots of camera angles and some nice details, this is a must play. Coming up next is Brawny Barnacle Bros by Jimmy Cultist. Featuring three pirate brothers in a race against time to get a treasure to avenge an old man? Ha! Ah, this one's worth your time. Coming up third is a pirate story, An Old Captain Bush, by Chevalier Boar. If you help me, you may find me after a long time in the sea. There is something broken inside of me. Come and find me, come and find me. The treasure's here, take your boat and come to me. The I could have swore the start of this was like watching a movie. The camera angle work was amazing. Coming up at fourth is Booty Cave Pinball by Steel Balloon. I mean, 
really can't complain. You've got pinball, you've got pirates, mix them together, that's a lot of fun. And finally, we've got Pixel Pirates by Avox23. Fun little hit and run adventure sees you as a pirate, fighting skeletons and grabbing treasure. Ah, <sighs> that's the life for me. Wow, those were some amazing pirate themed adventures. Congratulations to all the amazing talent featured today. The work was amazing. All that's left is to tell you next week's theme is going to be medieval, as voted on by the Patreons. If you would like to contribute to the show, you can become a Patreon over at Patreon slash Katsu. It really does help me work on the show. But that is us done for today. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next week. Bye!